So my question reads, high blood cholesterol can lead to cardiovascular problems such as osteoporosis and a heart attack. Exercise and monitoring of diet can often control cholesterol levels. However, in certain cases, HC is inherited as an autosomal dominant disease caused by a mutation of a single gene. A man with high cholesterol levels is about to marry a woman whose total cholesterol levels are also higher than average. A physician has suggested they get tested for the HC allele. Which of the following is a valid ethical question concerning the test? A. How important are the results of the test to the couple's health since they already know they have HC? B. How can they eliminate the allele for FC, HC from their cells? And C. If both have the allele for HC, should an insurance company raise their rates because of the results of the test? And D. What cures are available for HC other than dietary changes and exercise? So to help me answer the question, I looked up what an ethical question is, and it's defined as a problem or dilemma involving conflict, choosing between equally desirable or undesirable alternatives or balancing options. So from this, um, I can eliminate any question that has just a really clear answer. So after reading the question, I know I can eliminate answer B because it is impossible to eliminate an allele in the first place, and that just kind of has a straight up answer. Um, also, I can eliminate A and D um, because they are both not ethical questions. A is an answer that can be answered based on real factual information, and the answer will give them more information about their health. So C, I came to C as the correct answer because it deals with the question of if the couple should actually get tested. If their results show they have the HC allele, they may have more um, problems and more, like they might be more prone to illness. So it might make sense that their insurance rates go up, but they really can't control that, so it's an ethical dilemma.